When did you learn how to shuffle your TCG deck? Actually, I never learned how to shuffle my deck. And at some point, I really wanted to know how these pros are shuffling their decks so smooth. Do you know any of these guys who are playing TCGs on a regular basis? And they are just shuffling their decks. And it looks like they are even doing the magic before playing the game. It felt a lot of times for me like this actually and in the last year I actually got taught how to shuffle my deck by a pro. Simon Nielsen actually showed me how I grab my deck and then I'm able to shuffle it the best way. There are many ways, don't get me wrong. There are many ways how you can shuffle your deck and we will not look at every technique in this video, but I really want to talk to you about why I think this is such an important topic. Because when you are a pro, this is something you just get used to, right? You're doing it on a regular basis and you don't even think about it anymore. But for a beginner player or a new player that has never played a TCG before, shuffling your deck can be even the challenge that keeps you coming to the game or makes you leave the game. Because I have family members that have never played a TCG before. And I guess if you're watching this video, maybe you have a family member or a friend like this yourself. And when you play just a casual game with them, not a TCG like Yu-Gi-Oh, Magic, Flesh and Blood, Yu-Gi-Oh, whatever TCG you're playing, but just a random card game and it comes to the point where someone needs to shuffle the cards. <clears throat> and that can be a barrier, right? Some people don't even know how to shuffle the cards on the most basic way, actually. Do you know these people who are shuffling the cards like this on the table? They are just throwing all the cards on the table and shuffling them like this and then piling them up again. Yeah. <laughs> I hope no one at the TCG tournament ever shuffles their cards like this. And also, do you hear this? Ah, the, these pros also, yeah, they're making so many noises when holding their cards and their decks. And ah, it's just, how are they doing it? How are they doing it? That was so, for so long on my mind. And if you believe it or not, like, of course, I, can sh I could shuffle the basics yeah, for a long time. But then finally... Yeah, I, I was keen enough to ask in the right moment and then I actually learned it. And I'm not a pro at shuffling my deck yet. Yeah, don't get me wrong. But like I said, this video is not, a, not only about how to shuffle your deck. It is also about like these basics that we are not thinking about anymore that we are getting so used to in the TCG community that for a new player, yeah, it's just a question mark. From what sleeves do you actually choose for your deck to how to shuffle your deck? And actually, let me show you. You know what? I don't really want to spun you on the fold, as we see, as we say it in German. But let me actually show you. Yeah, a pro actually does shuffle his deck like this, right? They are holding the cards like this, the most turned way away from their head. So they can't see the cards anymore. And that not only has to do with them not wanting to seen as a cheater, but also they, they want to make it look as professional as possible, right? That's also like, there is a video online. I, I think many of you TCG players has seen that one where someone is shuffling his cards like so fast. I maybe even link it down. He has a flesh and blood store. I think he opened up the first flesh and blood store. He's a, I'm not sure, a Japanese content creator. I'm not sure, but it's a pretty old video, but that one has many views. And I was like, whoa, <laughs> I will never be able to shuffle my cards like this. So the first thing, yeah, I think you need to really learn if you want to be a pro shuffler is that you are really, you are, okay, uh, you see, I'm not the best yet, but 
you're, you're looking away, right? You're looking down or I don't know where you're looking, but definitely you're not looking at your cards. And then, do you see that? Like, I always, like, before I learned it, I always try to stuff my cards and I'm like, why is this not working? And of course it's not working, Leo. <laughs> it's, it's a little bit funny to show this, but it's serious, guys. Like, some people really yeah, need to learn this. Like, I, I myself needed to learn this. And do you see this? It's smooth. Oh my goodness. It's so smooth and it's like, I hope you can see this, like, do you see this? I'm sticking them in from the top, but only with one corner. And that was the thing that the light bulb goes on. Sebastian, you were there too. I'm, I'm actually like, Sebastian was making fun at me because I, I couldn't shuffle like I will never forget that Sebastian. <laughs> so this is just the smooth way and the easy way, right? So you are not trying to punch your cards in and just letting them fall. This is not shuffling, right? Sticking them in like this. You really want to like, like this, yeah? The, the cards really going side by side. And when you see this, oh my goodness, yeah, this looks satisfying, right? Um, guys, if someone comes to your locals or is starting the game and they are asking you how to shuffle the deck like a pro, you are showing them how to shuffle your deck like a pro. Don't make fun of these people. Show them how to shuffle, yeah? It's just as important as learning the basics of any TCG and getting to know all the cards and all the effects and all the combos and all the pitfalls. Yeah, maybe it just starts with a question like this. Yeah, how to shuffle a TCG deck as smooth as possible. And let me show you this again. Oh my God. Oh my goodness. And they go in like this. Like I said, we will not yeah, and then also like, can you remember? Like, this is this is not as an expensive deck. Like, but sometimes I see people with a thousand euros worth of a deck, and they are shuffling the deck, and then they are doing this. Do you hear this? They are literally punching the deck on the table. I'm like, Whoa. <laughs> okay. Like when I started to play the game <clears throat> of a TCG, and I got an expensive deck, I was okay. I'm. None of these cards should ever be punched. I wanted to be as secure as possible with my shuffling. And I'm really curious, like I thought about this a lot. And what are the real basics, yeah? Even before touching any card that a newbie coming to a TCG might have on their mind. Yeah, as, as funny as the question might be. And I think it's, it's really essential yeah, that all of these questions get answered for any new player in TCG. And maybe yeah, if any of you watching this is a new player to a TCG, maybe even Flesh and Blood, my current favorite TCG, I hope you could learn how to shuffle your deck properly. Actually, I think it's, it's the essence of this video. And let me show, to, show it to you yeah, the last time. Stick it in like this and you see this just with the one corner. It's pretty easy. And like I said, if you want to even make the pro, you, you are watching away, watching somewhere else when shuffling. Okay, guys, thank you so much for tuning in today's video. And if you want to see more TCG related content, subscribe to the Fabled Academy and watch one of the next videos.